sometimes you have a tendency to get kind of sloppy. How are you looking to kind of improve that? Sloppy in what way? A sloppy, like, kind of penalty and stuff like that. I had zero pass interferences, zero holdings, so cut the tape on again. I think you might see something else. Most of my life, my mom was battling non-Hodgkin's lymphoma. She was also a nurse. She went to work with a fresh mindset, and I never heard her complain at one time. I could tell to my kids one day and then tell them about the perseverance to really be a true fighter. Texas kind of has this uh, almost cliche reputation of being uh, you know, where high school football lives at its highest level and uh, people love to talk about uh, who gets drafted and how many get drafted and uh, you know how, how many get signed to FBS programs every year. Jeff Okuda is one who really stands out to me as the, the years progressed. Um, he got just a little bit bigger and really got better and better and better athletically. He really worked on the technical aspects of his game as far as coverage goes. And, you know, he became one of the best cornerbacks in the country for his class. Defensive player of the year. He may not have gaudy stats, but when quarterbacks are too afraid to throw your way, well, stats can be kind of hard to come. The bobblehead, what do you think of the man? It's been pretty accurate, uh, pretty dead on with the goatee and everything. I was going to say, a lot of detail involved <laughs> yeah, in that. So. I like that. Shut down corner. I know you like that term a lot, probably. What do you think of when you hear the term shut down corner? Uh, I think of just going to the best receiver on the other team and just taking him out the game, making it 11 on 10. Yeah, I don't want them throwing it in my direction. I don't even want them running it to my direction. I like to think that it, it made the football field, instead of 53 yards wide, 44 yards wide, because from the top of the numbers on that side, it was ours. Mm. Uh, and people challenged Jeff from time to time, and there were a couple of guys that caught a ball on him, but they didn't do it twice. Oklahoma, yeah. Florida State, and one other one, Ohio State, correct? I mean, what what has this process been like for you? It's got to be stressful, but exciting at the same time. It's been crazy, but at the end of the day, it's also been a blessing just to be able to get recruited by some of these schools. And, uh, and it's coming to an end, and I'm ready to make an impact on the next level. This is the Urban Meyer gets another great cornerback. Why the decision to go to Columbus? Um, from when I got there, I was just comfortable with the coaching staff, the plan they set up for me. They uh, put a lot of defensive backs in the NFL and uh, the life outside of football. And they, they just had the whole nine yards. Could have gone anywhere in the country to come here. Has it worked out the way you wanted it to so far? Definitely. Uh, just to be able to compete against the top receivers in the country. I'm from uh, one of the most uh, prestigious defensive back coaches in the country. I'm just, I'm just really excited. that second half, we can just play at such a higher level right now. Works on Latimer, Malik Hooker, those, those guys were really high in terms of grades. I think Okuda is as good, if not better, than all of them. 2020 NFL draft. There it is. There it is. Hey, Bob, from the Detroit Lions. How you doing? Are you out with your family? Yeah, I got my family. I got my family with me right now. Okay. Well, listen, give me one second here. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to conference in Coach Patricia. All right, we got something to tell you. Hold on. Coach Patricia. I have Jeff Akuti here. And uh, Jeff, welcome to the Lions. We just made you the third overall pick in the draft. Thank you so much, Coach. Uh, I'm blessed. I feel blessed right now. Thank you so much. Yes, sir. Thank you so much. Jeff, you know, in the entire process, you've done everything right. So uh, can't wait to get you up here whenever that is. And, um, you know, we'll, uh, we're going to let you go celebrate here with your family right now for a little bit. And then, obviously, just keep your cell phone close. Uh, you know, another person from our team will be calling you. A couple of the coaches will be calling you. And uh, our PR director will be calling you as well. Um, yes, we, uh, we're going to send this into the league here in about another minute or so and make it official. But uh, welcome to the Lions. Okay. Okay? Yes, sir. All right, man. All right, man. All right, take care. Uh, yeah, all right. See you.